The trial of five Zimbabwean war veterans accused of undermining the authority of President Robert Mugabe has been rescheduled for Wednesday. The trial, expected to have begun on Tuesday, involved the former Secretary General of the Zimbabwe National Liberation War Veterans Association, Victor Matimadanda, and former spokesman of the association, Douglas Mahia, as well as three others. We came here intending to commence the trial of Douglas Mahia and other war veterans. Unfortunately, the matter could not commence because the state prosecutor indicated in the morning that his wife was unwell. The five had in July issued a statement denouncing support for the 92-year-old president. They are being tried for undermining uh, the authority of the president it, or insulting the president. It being alleged that uh, sometime on uh, the 27th of July uh, 2016, they sat down, uh, all of them, and connived to craft a communication which ultimately was insulting the office of uh, His Excellency, the President of the Republic of Zimbabwe. Analysts say the five veterans could face up to 10 years in jail if convicted. Zimbabwe has been rocked by a wave of protest in recent times over the worsening economic situation in the country, with many of the protesters calling on President Mugabe to step down. There have been renewed protests this month over the government's decision to introduce bond notes for use in the country. Mugabe, who has resisted pressure on him to resign, at the weekend told a group of non-combatant veterans that if he were to retire, he should be allowed to do so properly.